Hello YouTube, it's Petra Gaming Scotland here and welcome back to another video. Hope you guys are well and gaming lot. So in today's video I'll be continuing to give out the trophies for my trophy awards. So in the last couple of videos we looked at the easiest platinum of 2019 and the best gaming mechanic of 2019. So in today's video we'll be looking at the best story driven narrative experience of 2019. There have been some fantastic contenders but before we get into the awards for the best story driven narrative experience let's take a look back at the best games of 2019. Twenty nineteen was a really fantastic year for games. Just look at them in that list there. So before we get into the award for best story driven narrative experience of twenty nineteen, I thought I'd look back at the games of this year. So this award was one of the most difficult to choose a winner for, as my main game and diet usually consists of story driven narrative single player experiences. So this is why this list is taking so long to prepare, as there's been so many fantastic story driven single player narrative experiences of 2019 but I think I've came down to two final games and also the winner my pick and the award for best story driven narrative experience of 2019 goes to a plague tale innocence now some people might not have heard of this game I personally hadn't heard of a Asbo studio the makers of a plague tale or a plague tale or any of the previous games as they are quite a new studio and I didn't know what I was letting myself in for and I'm glad I went in fresh and blind to this fantastic game. Now the story is very impactful from the very beginning. A couple of big events happen right at the start. I will not spoil anything of the game and I don't like spoilers myself. So it's very impactful and you go on a quest or a journey throughout different environments. Dark, gritty, dingy places full of disgusting, dirty rats and by playing through the rats and by playing a lot of story driven experiences uh, with a lot of puzzles in there thrown in for good measure you eventually finish the game but the main lasting impact that the story had on me was profound I really enjoyed characters of the story purpose of going on that quest and I personally think if any parent out there was in the same situation having an ill or very sick child you would do anything to get justice for your child or you would go you would as far as humanly possible to find a cure for a chronic illness such as the one Hugo had in this game who is the brother of Amicia the main character in the game and it just has a massive impact and feels just horrendous that people have had to go through this horrific illness in the face of adversity and a lot of diversity in a very horrible world of that time period so that is why Playtale Innocence is my best story driven narrative experience of 2019 as always let me know your thoughts down below of what has been your best story driven narrative experience of 2019 it could be a big AAA game or a smaller indie game. But as always, let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. But that has been the end of today's video. Thank you very much for watching. I've been Peter Game in Scotland and I'll see you on another video. Thanks very much indeed, guys. Bye-bye.